Hi, let's do some bowspring. Crouching cat, please. Hands as wide as the mat, feet as wide as the mat, or, or as wide as your shoulders or hips, maybe more, makes more sense. And the shoulders are behind the wrists, so we have a bit of a slant here, so it's not a straight stack, which will feel quite heavy for the wrists. And also you'll notice as soon as I take my heart forward, my heels really lift, so we root the, hip, the, the hips back and take the shoulders behind the wrists, pulse through the center, sit hips back wide, reach the ribs forward. And keep pushing the fullness into the back of the heart, crown reaching forward, hips dragging back wide. Pause connected, pushing down and out to the side. Heels drag back, extend the posterior chain, feel your glutes rise. Externally rotate right hand, twist cat left. Toes left, knees left, sit the hips towards the heels, rise up through your ribs. And dome left fingertips. Hips drag back wide towards the right, open belly bows to the left. Eyes looking towards your fingertips, chin lifted, throat open. And drop the right, pick up the left, one arm, one leg, side balance. Root your right femur back into the hip socket, ear to shoulder, rising left ribs. Little sticky pedal, a resisted pedal. And can you get your left glutes to engage? Hips back, belly bowing, rising ribs. And find some stillness. Left hand plants down on an external rotation. Revolve your kitty. Left knee sweeps underneath of you and steps along the side of the right. Sit the hips towards the heel. Reach right seed forward and long. Hips drag back and wide towards the left. Open belly bows right. Single crown, right seed, top of the head. Use this as a resistance to push more length into the throat, more length into the belly. Hips drop low, thighs pull back. Open and peeling open. A re revolving kind of bloom. One more pulse. Back through center. Two hands forward, left leg stays lifted out to the side, open leg. Crouch right foot, so heel is hovering. Hips move back and wide, right ear to right shoulder, rise up through your left ribs. Left knee hugs in, hips back, open belly. And stay here, or play with balance. Left seed to the front of left knee. Little resistance when they meet, can you find lightness, a strong pickup, a push into the ribs? Maybe this hand creeps to the inseam to catch the left foot. Yo! If you catch the foot, slow kick out. Inflate the ribs. Right knee hugs externally, rooted paw, hips back wide, open belly. One more full inhale wherever you are. Exhale, release the paw if you caught it. Rebend through the knee. Left foot steps forward, lower right knee down to the mat. Maybe you will like a block in front of you. Untuck right toes. Sit the hips back and wide and then reach the ribs forward. Left foot on an external rotation, relatively close uh, in terms of not so far ahead, but relatively close in alignment with the knee. Hips back wide, open belly. Stay here or you can play a little advancement for sure. So this is a, a bit of a hyper advancement, but take it if you want it. Left hand underneath of your left leg, place it beside your foot. Right hand catches right paw, hips drag back wide, extend. I think this is like a compass pose, but can you keep it bowspring, root hips back, open your belly, rise up through your right ribs. And chin lifted, throat open. One more full inhale if you've caught this. Exhale, release the foot back down. Two seeds forward, sweep over to the right. 
Hips pulse back and wide, ear to shoulder, rise through the ribs. X to see the left hand, catch behind the head and peel open. Got some plant problems here. And so hips pulling back and wide, ear to shoulder, rising ribs. It's mostly the hips that are moving and then we pick up into the ribs, head presses back into the hand. Lightness underneath the right armpit, strong push. Rising ribs, hips back wide. Dig, drag the left paw, pick up the foot, hero ankle. Knee hugs forward, hips move back, begin to bow it open. Little pulses, knee forward, hip back, bow open. One more knee forward, hip back, bow it open. Left foot lands outside edge of right thigh. Sit the hips back towards the heel and over to the left side. Dome left fingertips in front of the right. Little pulses here or you can just sit into the seat. We're searching for a big stretch all along the glute med. Sit back, unlink your leg, two seeds forward, pulse the hips back, arms rise, lift up, high lunge. So feet hip distance apart um, or on railroad tracks, hands to the hips, give, her a little, give the hips a little flip, taking them to an anterior tilt, hands to the bum, grab low, spread wide, lift up from behind, extend through the left leg. Little pulses, domes to the tops of the thighs. You can keep the, the domes high or you can creep them low as long as you can keep your lower lumbar moving in and your belly long. Rebend into your front knee, hips stay rooted back. Horseshoe hold, left hand to the top of left thigh, right hand ecstasy. Big parallel park, right butt goes over to the right, arch over to the left and push space into the left side as you rise into the right. Head presses back into the hand, big arch over. First stop is here, second stop sits deeper, roots hips more back. Left hand creeps, to the, um, creeps underneath of your left thigh to catch the outside edge of your right knee. Once you've hold, got this bind, resist the knee against the hand, hips back, big parallel park, right butt right. Reaching elbow over to the left, bow your belly forward, open it up. Toes connected, big full breathing, hips back, open belly. And then release, rise back up, two seeds forward. Find a pause, find your breath. Little spring, infinity pose. Heel connects to Right heel connects to either the shin or to the knee. Standing leg stays bent. Right knee narrow, hips back wide. Push fullness into the back, lift up the chin. This can stay relatively neutral or we can begin to bow it open. Keep your arms reaching forward and it's not the arms that are moving, but it's the ribs and the belly that are moving. So we lift the chin, belly bows, push fullness into the back heart, whole rib cage expanding. One more full inhale. Exhale back to a neutral spine, right leg crosses all the way over, phoenix kickstand. Knees squish forward, hips move back, sweep hands back, ecstasy, rise through the center, lift up, lengthen the belly. One more big extension. Right leg out to the side, open leg. Connect your left seed to the crown of the head, single crown. So right seed connects in front of right knee, little resistance, hips move back wide, open up the belly and then bow open. Chin lifted, throat open, rising energy, rooting hips back, knee hugs forward, hips move back. 
Extend your left arm long. Root your left femur back into the hip socket. Keep connect. Right seat to right knee. Resist the whole way down. Left hand lands. You might like a block here. Um, lands to the left side of the mat. Hand plants down. Right hand right beside the left hand. From here, root your left femur back into the hip socket. Widen the hips behind you and then push the ground away. Inflate into your back ribs. Into your side right ribs. Feel your belly lengthen and tone. Right knee hugs in. Hips move back wide. One more full inhale. Exhale. Deep bend into your left knee, coming up how we came in. Two seeds forward. Right ankle over top of left thigh. Knee stays narrow, sit the hips back and wide. Arms rise, pump down, lift ribs high. Place your hands, seeds to the tops of the thighs. Lift length into the belly, into the ribs. Chin lifted, throat open. Sit deeper, hips root back. Hands to the shin, resist the ribs forward. Option, right hand to the left heel. Left hand wraps around to catch the inside edge of your right thigh. Meow, meow, how's your leg? Breathe into it, mind over matter. Little twist, hips back, open belly. One more full inhale. Exhale, step the foot to the side. Shift weight to the right. Dig, drag left, picks up the foot, hero ankle. Heel press, connect the back of the heel, reach right arm forward. And then catching the outside edge of the ankle. Knee hugs forward, hips move back. First stop stays, balancing. Second stop comes with me, rebounds halfway or all the way. Your hamstring will tell you when. It's time to kick into the hand to lift back up. So nice and slow. The torso moves as a unit and just hinging at the hips. Left knee hugs into the midline, belly stays long, chin stays lifted, throat stays open. Next time you come down halfway, we'll hold. With grace and control, left knee hugs in, root right femur back into hip socket, two domes down to the mat, dome side to bright. Arms push strong, inflate back heart. Eyes look forward, hitch kick side to side. Paint a rainbow with your bum. The legs are just along for the ride. Next time you land on your right foot, stay. Step across your mat. Diagonal starter block, deep squat, rise up. Little pulses, hips back wide, arms pump down, ribs rise. Two seeds push forward, shift weight into the left foot, dig, drag right, picks it up. Extend the right leg back behind you. Big bend into the left knee. Top of the right foot meets the ground. Drag the top of the foot towards the knee to slowly lower the knee down. Sit hips back wide, big arch over to the right, rise through left ribs, hips back, plant the hand down. X to see the left, ear to shoulder, rise ribs. Option, wishbone, left hand catches right forearm, eyes look down to the ground, spiral the ribs open. Hips keep pulling back and wide, bow your belly forward, peeling open. Option, stay in either ecstasy or a wishbone or option, play. And take the left hand ahead of the right and take your eyes and check out your left foot. 
Now shift the weight into the left hand and take your right hand to catch your left ankle. So it crosses in front of you. And then pick up your foot here over the ankle. Hips drag back wide, push the ground away with the left hand, rise into your left ribs. Bow your belly forward as the hips resist back. Big stretch, hips back, open belly, push the ground away, find lightness. One more full inhale. Exhale, replace the foot back down. Right hand replaces. Pick yourself back up, plant hands forward. Tuck the toes, lift the knees, crouching cat. Pedal the heels. Narrow the knees. Walk the hands wide and walk the knees back. Set up panther prep. Hamstring hug heels to the bum, get your glutes lifted up. Those supercharge the butt, inflate into the back. Big hollows in your groins will come down halfway, elbows pull apart. Keep space between the shoulder blades and then lift back up. Couple pulses up and down, nice and slow, searching for that belly tone. Space, spaciousness, whole rib cage expanding, all sides, crown reaches forward, hips pull back. And then take your forearms to the mat, lower your hips down, lower your belly down. <clears throat> a little tummy time. Make a little flower cup with your hands so that your head can rest. Elbows are wide, shoulder blades broad, and you can just tick tock your legs side to side. Rise back up, hands wide. So it's like the hips are gonna pull us back. We're gonna dig, drag the knees down to start the, the source of the glute engagement. Hamstring hug, heels to the bum. Arms are going to help us, facilitate us by lifting us up, but the hips are what take us back. So it looks like. Shh. Hands walk to the mat. Tuck your back toes, lift up, crouching cat. Let's take a couple of hops on the spot. Eyes forward, big hops. Hopping with an open belly, push the ground away. Legs long for the ride. Keep the knees hugging in, move with the butt. Open it up, belly opens, eyes way forward. Land down, crouching cat. Hmm. Knock the knees into the center. Little hip shift side to side. Keep full through the back. Hmm. Find your roots. Shoulders behind the wrists. Push the mat away. Inflate the back. Pause rooted. Pushing down and out to the side. Heels drag back. Extend posterior chain. Glutes rise. Externally rotate left hand, twist cat right, toes right, knees right, sit the hips, ear to shoulder, rise through your ribs. Little pulses bend and extend through the legs, hips drag back wide, open belly bows, rising ribs. And drop the left, pick up the right, one arm, one leg, side balance. Root your right, uh, what is your left femur back into the hip socket. Hips wide to the left. Open belly to the right. Right knee hugs forward. Lift up through your right ribs. Maybe a little sticky pedal.
And find some stillness. Right hand plants down. Revolve your kitty. Right knee sweeps underneath of you and steps long beside the right. Set the hips towards the heel. Reach left seat forward and over to the right. Deep seats. Knees pull back towards the belly. Bow belly. Peel it open. Chin single crown. Revolving open like you're blooming. One more pulse. And two hands back forward. Right foot steps forward. Lower the left knee down. Right foot doesn't land so far ahead of your knee. In fact, the heel is essentially in line with the knee in my case. Option for a block. Just pulsing into the inseam of your right thigh. Hips move back and wide, belly stays open. Left toes, hero ankle. Right foot on an external rotation feels good to me. Big sweep over to the left, rise through your right ribs, hips back, belly bows, rise up, arch over. And then we'll plant the left hand down, give yourself some space, two or three feet. And in line with the outside edge of your knee, X to see the right hand, ear to shoulder, rise up through your ribs. Hips pulse back and wide, soft belly bowing, rising, arching. One more pulse here. And dig, drag, right paw, pick up the foot. Knee hugs forward, hips move back. Open, begin to bow the belly. Knee forward, hip back, bow it open. Knee forward, hip back, bow it open. One more full inhale here. Lightness underneath the left armpit, open it up. And then place the right foot to the outside edge of your left thigh or knee, dome right hand in front of the left, sit your hips back towards the heel and over towards the right and getting into your whole right glute med. So hips is like a big parallel park to the bottom right hand corner of the mat here. Unlink your foot, place it back where it came from. Sit hips back, open belly, two seeds forward. Find fullness in your rib cage. Sit the hips back, arms rise, pump down, lift up, high lunge. Hands to the hips. Give them a little flip. Hands to the bum, grab low, spread wide. Lift up from behind, extend through the right leg. Keeping a pocket in the back of the knee, domes can meet the tops of the thighs. You can keep these domes high or you can walk them a little lower depending on flexibility. Belly long, spine aligned, chin lifted, throat open, little pulses if it serves. It's like a, a swing with your hips. Find some stillness. Right hand horse, uh, bend into the knees, hips back. Right hand horse, you hold to the top of right thigh, left hand ecstasy. Head presses back into the hand, throat opens, belly opens. You're gonna take a big parallel park, left butt to the left as we rise and arch over to the right. Push space with your right hand into the right side as you lift through the left ribs. First stop stays here. Second stop sits deeper, roots the hips more back. Right hand creeps underneath of your right thigh to catch the outside edge of your left knee. When it catches this, resist the knee against the hand, hips back, bow your belly forward, reach your elbow long to the right side. Big parallel park, left butt left. 
Be here, breathe. One more big full inhale. Exhale, release the bind, rise up, two seeds forward, take a pause and breathe. Moving to infinity, little spring, left heel connects to the shin or to the knee. Standing leg is bent, left knee is angled more forward, hips back wide. Push fullness into the back, lift up, lengthen the belly, lift the chin. So staying neutral here, or pushing it a little more open, we'll say. Pushing fullness through the back, the belly lengthens, and the ribs rise to go up and back. Chin lifted, throat open. One more full inhale. Exhale back through center, cross left leg all the way over. Knee squish forward, hips move back, sweep hands back ecstasy. If you prefer a single crown or a hug, you can go for that. Whatever you're kind of looking for, ecstasy is great for rising and opening the belly. Um, crown hands is great for finding more length in the belly, more length in the neck. Hugs are great for love and just, you know, squirming around. Whatever you need here. Knees forward, hips back, root down to rise up. Big inhales lift you up. And then back through center. Left leg out to the side, open leg, connect left seed to left knee. Reach right arm forward and long and then connect single crown. The left knee stays narrow. Resist seed to knee, hips back, open belly, reach into your crown. One more full inhale. Exhale, hinging at the hips, root right femur back into the hip socket. Right arm slowly comes down towards the right side, resisting left knee to seed the whole way down. Hips back, open belly, maybe you need a block. And then two hands to the block, rising. Root right femur back, knee, left knee hugs in, hips move back, push the block away. Or no block. Hands plant down, one beside the other, and we push from here, pushing so strongly ground away to rise into our left ribs, hips back wide, open belly. One more full inhale. Exhale, coming back up. Root femur back, rise up. Cross left ankle over top of right thigh. Whew, this is challenging. Knee narrow, hips back wide. Arms pump down, li ribs lift high. Place seeds to the tops of the hot thighs for a lighter seat. Sit deeper, hips root back, maybe hands to the shins. Resist ribs forward, root hips back. Maybe, left hand catches left heel. Right hand reaches around behind the back to catch the inside edge of your left thigh. Little twist. I'm loving this so much right now. Like this is my favorite thing, this twisty cross ankle squat. Bound. Bound, twisted, cross ankle squat. Hips root back, one more full inhale. Exhale, unwind the bind, step the left foot to the side. Shift weight to the left. Dig, dig drag right, picks up the foot, heel kicks the bum. Heel press, engage back line, left arm reaches forward and long, and catch the ankle. Outside edge of the ankle, hero the foot, rebounds. Right knee hugs forward, hips move back and wide, push fullness into the ribs, and then coming down halfway, or all the way your hamstring will tell you when it's time to kick into the hand to lift back up. And toes connected, right knee hugs to the midline, hips back wide. Next time you come down, we'll hold. 
rooted toes, hips back with grace and control. Release the ankle, hug your right knee in, root hips back wide, two domes down to the mat, dome side to bright, arms push strong, inflate the back, eyes forward, hop, side to side, hitch kicks. So moving with the bum, gliding the hips side to side, legs just along for the ride. If you want more spice, cross kicks. Twisting the hips in the air, arms push so strong, eyes look so forward. Land back. Oh, nope, I lie. Don't land back. Um, if you're cross kicking, we're not gonna cross kick anymore. We're just gonna land with the left foot. Diagonal starter block, right foot steps across. Sit deep into your seat to rise up. Ooh. Take a pause. You might need one. I need one. Big full inhale and deep exhale. Cool. Two seats forward, little pulses, hips pulse back wide, belly stays long, open, filling into the ribs. Pumping down more space into the belly. Chin lifted, throat open. Okay, shift weight into the right foot. Dig drag left, picks it up. Hero to ankle. Hinge at hips, takes the torso forward. Big bend into the right knee, extend left leg back behind you. Take the top of the left foot down to the mat. Drag the top of the foot towards the knee to slowly lower the knee down. Sit hips back wide. Big arc over to the left. Rise through your right ribs. Sit hips back. Plant your left hand down. Give, your sp spa <laughs> Give yourself space two or three feet and in line with the outside edge of your knee. Right hand ecstasy. Ear to shoulder. Lift through the ribs. Hips back wide. Rising ribs, head presses back into the hand, reaching elbow nice and slow, big full breaths. Option wishbone, right hand catches left forearm, eyes look down to the ground as you spiral the ribs open, hips back wide, bow belly forward, rise ribs. Option stay here in either of those variations or option to place your right foot in front, what is your hand foot? <laughs> right hand in front of the left. Take a peek underneath of your arms to check out your right foot. Shift weight into the right hand and take your left hand underneath of you, cross in front of you to catch the right ankle. So left hand to right ankle. Pick up the foot, hero the ankle. Hips drag back. Open your belly forward, push the ground away with your right hand as you rise into your ribs. So rising ribs, hips root back. Peel your belly forward and open. One more big full inhale, breathe into this, open into this, rise into this. Exhale, releasing back down. Two hands forward. Tuck your back toes, lift the knees, crouching cat, pedal the heels. Pulse through the center, inflate through the back. Externally rotate right hand, twist cat left, toes left, knees left, hips back, ear to shoulder, rise through the ribs. Drop the right, pick up the left, one arm, one leg, side balance. And stay here with dome connect or connect left seat to left knee. Little resistance when they meet. Root this rooted leg, back, extend. Ear to shoulder, rising ribs. 
maybe begin to revolve open ear connects to shoulder heart begins to peel to sky keep a gentle resist seed to knee hips back and wide open 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 so slow one more full inhale exhale back through center crouching cat pulse through the middle hips back wide ribs pull forward Externally rotate left hand, twist cat right, toes right, knees right, hips sit back, ear to shoulder, rise the ribs. And drop the left, pick up the right, one arm, one leg, side balance. Root left femur back into hip socket, hips back wide, rising ribs, open belly. Stay with dome connect or maybe play right seed to the front of right knee. Little resistance when they meet, moves hips more back, opens up the belly more. Can you find lightness, liftedness, chin lifted, throat open? Maybe you stay or maybe you start to revolve open. Keep connect, ear to shoulder. Heart begins to spiral open to sky. Gentle resist, seed to knee, rooted left toes. One more full inhale. Back nice and slow. Twist cat right, twist cat left, sorry. Lower right hip down to the mat. We'll just take the left hand in front of us, hips back, chin lifted, throat open. So just landing how we landed, hips behind the heart, long open belly, little micro bend in your elbows. I've got a hyperextension um, tendency, so that is a constant cue for me. And then we will reach our right arm long to the left side. Allow your left leg to drape over top of your right and, pre and just like revolve two seeds to sky. Open heart. And back through center. Two seeds or two forearms forward. When you start working hard, your brain stops working, which is a good thing, um, but an interesting thing when you're trying to teach. <laughs> Observations. I'm like, Bleh. Talking. Hands plant down, tuck your toes. Twist back up, crouching cat. Inflate into the back, hips back wide. Quick twist to the right, lower left hip down. Dome right fingers in front of you, stay high. Hips behind the heart, chin lifted, throat open. We'll extend our left arm long towards the right corner of the mat. Allow your right leg to drape over top of the left, hips behind the heart. If you need to like shimmy them back, you can. And then press two seeds high to the sky to revolve heart to sky. Sunshine. Back through center, two forearms forward. And push fullness into your back, chin lifted, throat open. And then we'll reach our left arm long again, roll back onto your side to roll onto your back. And shimmy onto the mat with the head, the hips, and the heart. And catch your knees, freedom pose, allow the knees to pull heavy. 
Chin lifted, throat open, little rock side to side. Extend your legs long. Hands to the bum, spread the cheeks. Give yourself a big bear hug, grab for the shoulders, spread the shoulders. Arms out to the side, palms up or down. Big full inhale. Mm. Exhale, let's it go. And do some little heel rocks. Kind of always feels like it sorts you out. And soften here for as long as you can. Feel your body melt, feel the vibration. Smile with it. Send yourself love, compassion for the process, for the practice, for the intensity and the duration. Thanks for being here. You guys are the best.